Rick Rayner worked for years as a Hollywood actor and has traveled the country with his outreach ministry. But now he wants to change lives through the big screen with his first feature-length film, The Rally. This movie's about giving hope, giving a word of encouragement. These stories in the movie are true stories. So uh, the vision came from when people see this movie, they'll be able to see themselves and say, wow, if that person in the movie can get help, there's help for me. My whole life has been this It's based on The Godfather, how we go into the story of how The Godfather controls the city. He controls the law, he controls the streets. We show a little bit of his story, who he is and how he does that. But instead of just focusing on his story in the movie, we take the viewers into the lives of four different families who are being affected by the Godfather's way of doing things. The film was primarily shot in Riverside and was produced by Reyna's production company, Reyna Sound and Stage. The company is run out of the 600-square-foot trailer next to the Reyna family home. Production on the film began early last year. Though it's just arriving in theaters now, it has already made an impact. The movie was shown in 35 of Florida's correctional facilities. After we showed this movie, we had life set in prisoners raise their hand and say, can you pray for me? In the movie, a group called Rallies for Christ arrives in a city that has long been riddled with crime and corruption. And they set up a free one-day concert in the park, in a parking lot. Well, they're coming to this city to do this event, but the Godfather finds out that they're coming in and they want to help the people, so he does whatever he can do to stop them from coming in. That's why this rally is so important. Rallies for Christ in the movie mirrors Reyna's real-life outreach ministry. It travels the country hosting community events and concerts and is made up of members of his family, including his four children. His children are also full-time employees of the company Reyna Sound and Stage. Reyna began his acting career at the age of 30 with appearances in a variety of commercials. His big break came when he worked as a body double for Al Pacino in such films as Heat and The Insider. A lot of new doors open because, you know, wow, you know, if, if, if you had an opportunity to do that, Al Pacino's double. So we just got a, a, most of our training, you know, working in Hollywood like that. Then you know what? The day came where we just felt God was simply saying now is the time to for you to start making movies, but making movies with a positive connection where people can connect to. The rally is Reyna's first attempt at making a feature-length film. He originally planned to shoot the film at the Warner Brothers Studios lot. That was until he was told it would cost him more than $500,000 for a seven-day shoot. So he decided to bring Hollywood out to Riverside. Filming in the IE, we could get a sense of reality for this movie to come alive. Permits to shoot in Riverside cost him only $300. It only seemed to make sense. Filmmakers need to uh, look beyond Hollywood because I honestly believe, believe this. If you shoot in Hollywood, you're going to have the Hollywood feel. And people are looking for more reality today. Reyna says it's not about how many tickets they sell. How many lives are we going to touch and help? What's next? The Rally 2. We're already working on the Rally 2. We got our script already done. We're already casting. In Ontario, Julianne Non, InlandSoCal.com.